Look, I can't let it go that, uh, unnoticed that looking like this, um, I'm always mistaken for a fella, right? Always mistaken for a guy, right? Um, it's not always a bad thing, uh, being mistaken for a bloke. Uh, it's quite good, actually, most of the time. Uh, always get both armrests on any form of public transport. Um, I love a bit of a spread, yeah. And ladies, I hate to fucking admit it, but fellas, mansplaining, oh! It's fuck satisfying, isn't it? Explaining things to women that they know more about than, oh! The more they know about it, the more satisfying it is. Can't, can't get over it. I can do it all the time. I'll, don't worry, I'll, I'll explain it to you later, babe. All right. Um, it's a complex, complicated joke. Oh, never mind. Um, anyway, uh, honestly, being mistaken for a fella doing stand ups fucking brilliant because I get off of twice as many gigs uh, for being half as funny as all the female comedians. So. You've got to take what you can get, haven't you? Anyway, uh, it does get a bit awkward being mistaken for a bloke in uh, women's public toilets, though. Uh, without, without fail, if I'm in a women's public toilet, someone will walk in and go, oh, shit, sorry. And <laughs> straight back out again, every time, right? Or they'll walk in, and if they're really desperate and they can't hold it, they'll walk in and pause and go, oh, fuck. And they're scurrying. Because <laughs> in the cubicle, you can, I can imagine she's like, ah, what well, the fuck just happened? <laughs> Doesn't smell like the gents, but <laughs> pretty fucking sure there was one in here. <laughs> anyway, I know she's not going to come out until I've gone, so sometimes a bit of fun, you know, I'll check my hair and check Facebook, <sighs> phone me nan for an hour, you know. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> but the other day, but they, you know, it doesn't bother me because normally we, we can like, uh, pretend it never happened, right? I don't come face to face with them, but yesterday, a woman walked in the toilets, looked me straight in the eye and she went, oh, shit, sorry, I thought this was the ladies. <gasps> She put, yeah. She paused, looked at me, looked at the sign on the door, looked back at me, and went, oh. No, never mind, even the piss, her arse has just fallen out. She's shitting herself. <laughs> at the social awkwardness she's just caused, and we can't get away from it, we're face to face. And I was like, but, oh my God, she was up, she went pale, she was mortified, she was sweating, I thought, oh God, I should really do something to help her out and relieve this tension. <laughs> But I won't. No. <laughs> no. First time ever I've had a chance to say something. I'm like, seriously, guys, seriously. Like, I, thought I couldn't let this go. It's 2021. Like, surely things have moved on about gender, right? So I turned to her. I went, listen here, sugar tits. <laughs> Can a woman not be tall? Have short hair? And just be, just be stood here? Pissing in the sink. <laughs> it's outrageous. What else is a sheep pee for? Anyway. It's outrageous. Anyway. 